Jackie West here reporting for the Press Enterprise and PE.com. Joining me is reporter John Asbury. We're at the scene of where a horrific crash took place Sunday evening around 6.30 p.m. on Highway 38 just north of Ukaipa. John, I understand that you had a chance to speak with CHP officials this morning. Can you tell us what they had to say? Right. CHP officials, they're still piecing together what exactly happened here. Um, it, some reports have said that the the bus was coming down from Big Bear down Highway 38 and uh, first rear-ended a, a Saturn and then crashed into a pickup towing a trailer. From there the bus rolled and then landed back on its feet. Um, so far the CHP officials are still counting all those involved. We have about eight fatalities and as many as 30 or 40 injured. Now they actually do still have bodies inside of the bus. Yeah, the way that the bus has crushed and when it overturned, they said it's not safe to go in. So what they're going to do is bring in a crane and with that crane uh, stabilize it. And then once it's secure, firefighters and coroner's officials will go inside the bus uh, to, first of all, recover any bodies that they have as well as look for any personal information or any identification to identify everyone involved. Okay. Now, have they said anything about who was at fault here? Uh, the, the exact cause of the crash is all still up in the air. Um, they did interview the driver at the hospital last night, and so far that they are looking at uh, mechanical issues as well as whether it was a driver error or not. Um, there was a report last night that the brakes failed, but we're not clear if that's the case here. Witnesses reported uh, the bus speeding down the mountain and uh, wheels smoking, so it could be just about anything. Do we know how long Highway 38 is expected to be closed? Last night they said about 24 hours, which would put it about 6 p.m. tonight. Um, CHP officials are going to be on scene here today. They're about to move the bus onto the road, and then once they're able to safely search it, um, they'll tow the bus for further investigation and uh, probably looking at least into this afternoon, if not into this evening. Definitely still a lot of cleanup that they have to do here. Stay with the Press Enterprise and PE.com for the very latest on this breaking news story. For the Press Enterprise and PE.com, I'm Jackie West.